All right, listen, um, I got to say this before I leave for today, um, before I go ahead and get my mind right uh, real quick. I just want to just say this. Listen, King Jobs ain't never went nowhere. Uh, I'm just trying to change up how I flow. But uh, I'm just going to say this because this needs to be said. This really needs to be said. I'm not trying to be deep. I ain't trying to be spiritual. I'm just going to state facts real quick. Um, ooh, yeah. All right, so I'm sitting here, and I didn't, you know, already gave y'all this this little message from today, and I'm really trying to help y'all understand something, but it's something that y'all really truly need to understand about all of this stuff that's going on. So, if you go through history, right? You go through history, and you look at everything that's been going on. Shouldn't you ask yourself the question: Why are we being killed like this? Should, should you not ask yourself the question, why is it that we are being hunted down like dogs? Should, shouldn't, that be, shouldn't that be a good, valid question? Why are we being hunted down like dogs? Like, no remorse for life, don't care. Just being hunted down like dogs. We should, we, that, should, that should make you ask yourself a question. Mm, 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 mm. And then tell me this Why ain't the preachers Okay So y'all asked me a question Why Mario you always going in on the church Because the church Is some of the main people That hold the secrets Right The church is some of the main people That hold the secrets What's up I saw you call me I'm going to call you back the church is some of the main people that hold the secrets. So since you hold secrets, let me go ahead and help you unveil the secrets. Here's a problem with black folks. Here's a problem with black folks. We got we we hold all the power. But we walk around dumb and we walk around stupid. We out here crying because this man is set up and blatantly killed. Blatantly killed. Blatantly. I say blatantly. I said it again. Blatantly. Blatantly killed this man in front of our eyes. But he did the same thing to Emmett Till, Trayvon Martin, Martin Luther King, Malcolm X, uh, 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 John, um, Sandra Bland, all of these folks. Blatantly killed running right in front of our face. Why? Before I even get here, I just, I just hold you. <laughs> Question, question, do y'all ever wonder why we are killed and people that kill us that don't look like us just get off? Do, do y'all ever think about that? Do you ever wonder? Do you ever wonder? Y'all make sure y'all share the video. Uh, share the video. Send it over there to me. You're not, you're not in the kingdom page. Do you ever wonder why we are killed in broad daylight and no one cares? Do you ever wonder why we are so big and we kill ourselves? Do y'all ever really think about that? Do you ever really wonder why the black church, we are so full of people and people love to go to church and jump and dance and shout? And yes, then we walk right out and we kill each other. Do y'all ever like really wonder, wonder about that? So I, I got something for y'all. See, this, 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 this makes a lot of sense to me. Uh, yes, I am a preacher and, and I, I gives the word, but it's something in this book that just made some sense. Some just, just, just Emily just made some sense. If I read this book, right? If I read this book and the book tells me and shows me that what nobody in this book white, but Esau, I mean, it was other people, but what nobody in this book white. Nobody in this book, and plus everybody that was around that time, was in hot climates. They weren't white. They weren't white. Y'all don't, y'all don't, y'all, there, there's something in here. There, there is something in here that they don't want, people don't want you to see about yourself. Let me break that down to you, and I'm done because I got stuff to do today. If you read this book right and not to beat somebody over the head about some sin, you realize you are right here in this book. You realize the reason why you are hunted 
is because we in the book, y'all. We in the book. We, and I'm not, whatever. We in the book. And we are God's people, right? We're God's people. And even in this book, I don't care how you preach it. I don't care how you lay it out. I don't care what you say. I don't care how you feel today because I'm going to go on and get me my feel good. I'm going about my business. I don't care what you feel about it. We in this book. And because we're in this book, it clearly lays out who we are, what we are, and the reason why we are where we are today. The reason why we are where we are today. If you go to Psalms, I think it's 83. Psalms 83. It even talks about us being put in slavery and being in slavery for years and being in slavery for years. And we're going to be spread amongst nations. Who been spread amongst nations? Black peoples. <laughs> y'all don't read, do you? Y'all mad about the white people killing you. But it said it was going to happen. Y'all want to talk about the size of the time? It said it was going to happen. And it's been happening. And don't y'all don't want to do y'all, y'all don't want to change. Put your glasses on. Put can you see me now? Can you see me now? Put your glasses on. We've been in this for years. We've been in this for years. We grew up preaching a white Jesus. Hey, 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 hey. Don't beat me down. I'm just the messenger. We've been preaching a white Jesus, but that's not history. That's not history. We've been suppressed because our, uh, um, our oppressor has put us in this. The Bible even said, God said, I will spread you amongst the nations. Because you don't want to follow me and do it, I'll put dung all across your faces. But see, this is the problem with us. We mad at what somebody else is doing to us, right? We're mad at what somebody else is doing to us. But what did we do? What did we do? What did we do? What did we do? So what did God tell us? What did God tell us? He said, because my own people, y'all better go to second Ezra. My own people don't want me. I'll go to somebody else and I'll put my hand of blessings on their life. Do I still love my folks? Absolutely. Because he said, I reign on the just as well as the unjust. Y'all don't understand. Are y'all understand that scripture right there? Y'all don't understand that scripture right there. He said, I write on the just as well as the unjust. I got my own people that are just. And I got my own people that are unjust. I got my own people that will follow me. And then I got my own people that are hard-headed and disobedient. But what I'm going to do for my folks, I'm going to go somewhere and I'm going to lay my hands of blessings on another people, the Khazars. And them Khazar Jews, them Khazar Jews. Them folks, they own the media, they own the world, they own the banks, they own the money, they own everything. And we sitting right here, it's a mess. And then y'all mad, y'all mad. You black folks, you coloreds, the Bible is black. Every Bible from the, 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 time, the, the, the time that they start making these things, black. Everybody. You don't believe your own history. You don't read. You don't study. Black people want peace, but you don't want peace. You want a handout. You ha ha can you help me? Can you can you help me? Can you help? Y'all want freedom, right? You want freedom, right? You want help me, help me, please, help me, help me, please, help me, please. You are Aunt Jemima. Y'all want to be house niggas. Y'all want to be pampered. You want Mr. White Man just make me feel good. Oh, don't whoop me, West, Mr. White Man. Oh, I tap dance for you, Mr. White Man. Oh, help me, help me, please, help me, help me, please. No, how come you can't help yourself? How come we can't build ourselves? Y'all want to sit out here and you want to ask somebody, please give us freedom. Please give us peace. When you can go take your freedom, take your peace. Y'all don't want that. Y'all don't want that. I just looked at an image right now. I just looked at an image right now of white folks standing in front of black folks and saying, stop this mess. 
You want somebody else to stand in the gap for you and you don't want to stand in the gap for your own self. That's a problem. That's a problem. That's a problem. Y'all want to get out here, you want NAACP, you want it March, Black Lives Matter and everything like that, but you yourself don't believe that you matter. Y'all believe. Y'all believe that you're more productive going to a Target, a Walmart, grocery stores, and burning down grocery stores. You think that that's effective. Ignorance is bliss. Ignorance is bliss. The problem that we have is that we want to operate in ignorance, but we don't want to operate in wisdom. We want to operate in ignorance, but we don't want to operate in wisdom. And see, this is what you don't understand. We are so blessed as other people, and yet and still we are hunted. Y'all don't, don't like this? It's right here in the book. It's in our book, Reading Rainbow. I ain't been able to sleep. I ain't been able to sleep for days. I get two hours here, three hours there, four, maybe one, two. Uh, listen, listen, listen to me. Listen to me. We are so blessed as other people. We done made everything that's around this world. We done built this country and everything. And yet and still, we still can't get free. Ain't that a problem? Ain't, ain't that a problem? I'm sorry, Chanel. Ain't that a problem? Ain't that a problem? Ain't that a problem? Mm -hmm -hmm. Ain't that a problem? Ain't, ain't that a problem? That's a problem. We have built something and yet and still we're slaves to it. We're slaves to what we built and we can't even walk in freedom. We're slaves to it. We didn't built it, but we can't walk in freedom. We get killed in what we built. We are destroyed in what we built. We're slaves in what we built. The 13th Amendment is going to put you back in slavery. In what you built. We're, we're, we're slaves to it. We're slaves to it. We're slaves to it. But y'all forgot. Y'all y'all preachers. 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 Mm, preachers, 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 preachers. Y'all preach the word, right? You preach the word, right? I'm a preacher too. You preach the word, right? You preach the word, right? You preach the word? You preach the word. Can I get an amen? Somebody say amen. Somebody say amen, knuckle. Somebody say amen. You preach this Bible, but why do we skip over our truth? We preach the Bible, but why, but why do we skip over our truth? Why can't we empower our people? Why can't we empower our people to say, stand up, stop this cutting up and stand up and be one? Because we still want a handout. Israel, you still want a handout, don't you? Don't you still want a handout? You still want food stamps. You, you want wig, Similac, milk. You still want to be renegades, don't you? you? You still want to be renegades, don't you? You want to be out here stealing stuff, acting like a savage. Sassy, boozy, ranchy. I'm savage. You want to be a savage, right? You want to be a savage. You want to be the whole of the nation. You still want to run up out behind somebody and say, give me, 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 when everything is already yours. Do it make sense? I, it makes plenty of sense to me. That's okay. That's okay. We can go in the book. We can go in the book. The books even talk about this. Don't, don't nobody want to talk about or read Deuteronomy 28. Don't nobody want to read Deuteronomy 28. Deuteronomy 28, we, we, we read this all the time in the church, talking about blessings, blessings, blessings. But if you don't do this, this is what happens. The country got laws, but you don't want laws. The country got laws, but you don't want to follow the laws, right? Oh, okay. So what your oppressors have done, mm, what your oppressors have done is taking the laws out the book and put them in the government. Now you got to abide by them. But they picked and choose too. Mm. But there is a way out. 
There is a way out. That's okay. The Bible says that the elect of God shall scarcely make it in. And that's one thing that I've learned. The elect of God shall scarcely make it in. Every one of y'all ain't going to make it because you don't want it. You want God to give you, give you, give you, give you, give you, give you, give you. You want God to give it to you, but you don't want him. You want the giver, but you don't want, you want the gift, but you don't want the giver. That's what it is. You want the gift, you want the gift, but you do not want the giver. You want the present, but you don't want the presenter. You want him to, oh, give me a house. Give me a car. Give me a man. I want sex. I need a man. I need children. Oh, help me, help me, help me, help me. You want a handout. You want a handout. Y'all Negroes rather go to a store and steal than to work for it. Give me, give me, give me, give me, give me. We're going to forever be in this place. We're going to forever be in this place. Why? Because we choose to be in this place. And Negroes, y'all going to work hard for the rest of your life until we realize that we have walked away from God. We rather follow creation than to follow God. And y'all want to tell me, well, Jazz, what you doing? Don't you worry about it because I'm going to tell you right here, I got to see God for my own self. How about that? Catch me outside. Negroes always want to point out somebody else's stuff. But then don't want to follow none. You let me tell you something. You go ahead, you go head on, and you worship how you worship. But what I have learned is this right here. Let every man, that's what the Bible says, let every man work out his own soul salvation with fear and trembling. That's what the Bible says. But what I've also learned is the Bible also says, be not concerned. It says, be not concerned with what these people do. My job is to give it to you and keep on moving. What I'm so tired of now, what I'm so tired of now is the fact that we're crying for help and we're crying for help and we're still burning down buildings. We're still burning down stores. We're still shooting and killing one another. We're still shooting and killing the police officers, burning up cars and give me, give me, give me, give me, give me, give me, give me. That's what you want. That's what you want. That's what you want, right? You want that, right? We're still burning up stuff. And we said, can you help me? Burning up stuff. Can you help me? Burning up stuff. Can you help me? Mm-mm. 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 You don't want it. You want a handout. You don't want God. You want a handout. You want justice and freedom, but you don't want to fight for it yourself. You got Negroes who are at home right now who are saying, I don't want to be involved in that. I'm not doing I'm not. Yeah, you got Negroes who don't want to do nothing. Niggas who don't want to do nothing but give me everything. That's exactly why women are the way that they are right now. I want a man to take care of me. I want a man to do this. I, oh, I want to, oh, I want, oh, you want somebody to give you, but you don't want to work for nothing. You want somebody to give it to you, but you don't want to work not, for nothing. Now you got sorry men. I'll tell you, listen here. Listen, if I just happen to slip today, it's just going to slip today. You got men who are the same way. Don't take care of their kids. Don't provide for their families. Walk out on their families. Walk away. Cheat on their wives. Cheat, 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 cheat. The Bible even says this. Yeah, the, the, the Bible said this over in Deuteronomy. It, it said this. Y'all forgot about that part, right? Y'all forgot about that. The Bible says that. The Bible says that you're going to have men fighting with their sons, men leaving their wives and not taking care of their families. The Bible says that. And nobody chooses to read that. Ain't nobody teaching no more. Oh, oh, I know what you want. And God said, uh, I, I will bless you in the morning, bless you in the evening. Woo, 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 woo. And I Y'all, y'all want it. Y'all, baby, y'all want it. Y'all want, baby, y'all want excitement. Y'all want excitement. But you don't want to live by nothing. You don't want to follow nothing. You want easy street. That's what you want. You want easy street. You want easy street. 
So until the day we die or the day that we finally recognize what's really going on, what we what's really going on, we're going to forever be in this state of mind. We're going to hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me go find it real quick because, you know, some folks, you know, you got to you got to prove you got niggas that want to be smart mouths and can what what book was it? What book? Um, oh, here you go. Here you go. Here you go right here. Psalms. <clears throat> I, Psalms. Psalms. Keep not, keep not thou silence, O God. Hear not thy peace. And be not still, O God. For lo, thine enemies. That's what it says. Thine enemies make a tumult, and they that hate thee have lifted up thy head. They have taken crafty counsel against thy people. Oh, it gets even better. I'm sweating today. I wouldn't even. I plan on being out here in the breeze and having a wonderful day. But it says they taken crafty counsel against thy. People, ain't that what the Bible say? Against thy people and the and consulted against thy hidden ones. Ain't that the Bible? Ain't that the Bible? Ain't that the Bible? Oh, okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on. They have said, Come, let us cut them off from being a nation. What they doing? What they doing? What 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 they doing? They smile in your face all the time, trying to take your place. Backstabbers, uh, backstabbers. I ain't had no sleep, y'all. I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm tired. Listen here. I listen here. Whatever. I'm tired. We cut off. We cut off. Mm -hmm. That's what the Bible say. What's up, little brother? That's what the Bible say right there. Let us cut them off from being a nation that the name of Israel may be no more in remembrance. Let's shut these people down so that they are no, that they no, don't know who they are, that they don't remember what's really going on, that they don't read the book, that they don't find out the knowledge. But wait a minute. What we've been doing all this time? We've been carrying a book. <laughs> We've been carrying the book. And, and, and we've been carrying the book the whole time. We, 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 we've been carrying the book the whole time. And we still dumb as a box of rocks. We've been carrying the book the whole time. We've been carrying the book the whole time. And still walking around here stupid. Still walking around here ignorant. Negroes got big old behind churches and full of dumb, ignorant black people. Mm -hmm. For they have consulted together with one consult, consent that they are confederate. Say that one more time. They have consulted together with one consent. They are confederate against thee. The tabernacles of Eden and Ishmaelite and Moabam Hagarite, all these other peoples and things like that, uh, is joined with them. They have helped the children of Lot, Selah, do unto them as they unto Midian, as the Midianites and all these other peoples, mm -hmm, which perish at Endor. They became as dung on the earth. Make their nobles like Oreb and like Zeb. Yea, all their princes and, and all these other peoples and things who said, let us take to ourselves the house of God in possession. Mm -hmm. Oh my God, make them like a wheel as the stumbles before the wind. Uh-huh. But y'all can read the rest of this for yourself. Y'all can read the rest of this for yourself. We preaching and ain't preaching nothing. You want to preach blessed? Oh, God said we got to have wisdom. And we got to have wisdom. How do we get wisdom? Reading. This, this, this is the problem with us. Still to this day, if a nigga wants knowledge, he's persecuted. If a nigga tries to help another nigga and to be smart, he's persecuted. Or, 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 if a nigga tries to help another nigga out, let me just call you what they call you, a byword. 
What do we do? We become crabs in a bucket because you become successful. You become successful and I want your success. I don't want to work for it. Yeah, that's still that spirit that's still upon us. We still cursed. We still crabs in a bucket. We don't want nothing. We don't want to work hard for it. We don't want to work hard. It don't matter what you are. It don't matter what you are. We don't want to work for it. We don't want to work hard. We just want free. Hand me out. Give it to me. I want it. Give me, give, give me, give me, give me, give me. That's what you want. Give me, give me, give me, give me, give me, give me. Mm -hmm. Give me, give me. We are a sorry race of people that have been cursed. And all we got to do is recognize what the problem is and we'll walk free. It, Omar, it's not that easy. You doggone Skippy. You doggone Skippy. It's not that easy because you're going to be tested and tried. Because I know I did. I was tested and tried. I was tested and tried. You're not just going to walk in knowledge. See, because the testing is, okay, I can give you the knowledge, but are you going to turn? Huh? What? What'd you say, Mickey? Oh, okay. I'm not fighting with nobody. I'm not fighting with nobody. I saw Perry. I know Mickey. She can call me. It is what it is. It it is what it is. We're going to be right here. We're going to be right. Oh, I'm blessed. Jobs, I'm blessed. I just got a new car. Oh, I'm blessed. I just got a new house. Oh, Jobs, I'm blessed. I just got married. My man got money. My woman got money. I got, we got money. You got, you got money? You got, you got money? What does that mean? You, you said we not... It's, it's okay. I'm, I'm, not mad. I'm not mad. I'm not mad and I will never be mad. Because we look blessed and still walking around here cursed. We look blessed and still walking around here cursed. We are a people that is downtrodden. Oh, I'm right. I have a good job. And you're still downtrodden. You're still downtrodden. You still got to respect somebody of another nation over you. You just got to still walk in fear because you don't want to be hung up in trees. You still got to walk up in fear because somebody has made you a subordinate up under them. Somebody made you a subordinate. It is what it is. I'm not going to fight. And I'm not going to argue with you. That day for me is done. If you don't believe it, that's fine. It's in a book. It's in the very book that you got tucked up under your arm. When I got ordained and everything, they gave us a book. And a band to put around our neck. Meaning that I am tied to the word. I'm tied to the book. I'm yoked up to this thing. It's fine. That It is what it is. It don't make sense. That's okay. It ain't going to make sense to everybody. I love y'all. Make sure y'all hit that follow button. Bye.